Oh god, let's play the game where I tried and failed to remember Idolish seven names. Palooza party, it's your girl Gigi, and you are watching Anime Palooza. Today it's time for my August Ami Ami haul. Ami Ami is an online store. They also have real stores in Japan where you can buy Japanese figures, Japanese goods, and merch of your favorite anime characters, video game characters. Whew, they have a lot of stuff, and I try my best to not go crazy every month when I buy from them. Um, very small, very small for August. Um, I did stupidly make two orders in August for August but one of them didn't come until September so I'm going to show you the second part of that with my September Ami Ami haul. I got some clear files. I have a very expensive figure and a bunch of other stuff so let's get our unboxing on. Unfortunately I had something else in this box um, that I gave to somebody already and I lost the Ami Ami card so I don't know which one it was but I don't keep those anymore anyway. Let's start with the big boy. Um, this figure was really expensive and like a couple months later, they were selling him for half price. They're not anymore. But this is Shiki Isaya from Idol Master Sidem. This is a 1 8 scale. <sighs> he is like up in the top five of my Idol Master Sidem boys. So he is from High Joker. And I love the little bear cutouts on the side of this box. So far, there are only two Artifacts J Kotobukiya scale figures from Idol Master Sidem. The other one is Pierre from Bait which I did not buy. i um, kind of kicking myself for that, but I might try to find him on the aftermarket somewhere because he was really expensive and I couldn't afford him at the time. Um, but Shiki is super cute. I love his little pink glasses. I like him a lot. Um, and this is actually like a nice box. For some reason I thought this was going to come in like an altar box and it, it's not altar, it's Kotobukiya, which is very expensive for Kotobukiya. It's like $120. Um, but he's cute. I love the details on his coat, the little frills and there's little buckles on it and stuff. And um, I like him. I'm sad that I wish I could have paid half price for him, um, but he's still a good boy. I love Shiki. I want to put him up, but as you can see I've just added to this and I have no room. Uh, but when I move, Shiki, you're gonna have a place of honor. You're a good boy. Let's do the clear file next. It's got products inside, so you know I ordered clear files. Only two, apparently. Um, and these were on sale. Um, they're both Idol Master side on. You can see the theme that's going on here. So I have Sem and Jupiter, and I believe I have more in another box, but I couldn't get the whole set of these. So here is my best band, Sem. They are good boys. Jiro Yamashita, my husbando. It's the brown haired dude. Love him. And then we have Jupiter, who are like the main Idol Master side M band. Just plain old white clear files. Um, here's the back. But yeah, these are super cute. I love them a lot. You guys know me and my clear file thing. It's still not going away. And I think once I move, I'm going to do a whole wall in clear files. Like I know they're like functional. I think I'm going to put them on my wall. Yeah, the clear file wall. I think it's definitely going to happen. Before I go on to the Nendos, um, I bought this in the Ami Ami sales section. These are Idolish 7 Omanjus and this is set number two. These are like those squishy beanbag things. And this set had Nagi in it, which is why I bought it. Um, it's got, oh god, let's play the game where I tried and failed to remember Idolish seven names. Yamato, Nagi, Mitsuki, Gaku, King Pudding, uh, Sumugi, who's that guy? Sogo? No, Sogo has white hair. I don't know who this guy is. And Tamaki. Well, Tamaki's in here, so Sogo must be in here, right? I love it on the bottom. It says Waku Waku Nagi. And it says Foo Foo. I don't know. Anyway, it's got eight of them in here. This is on the sale section. So it was like under $20. So I just bought it. Not that I have ambitions on doing an Idolish 7 eat a bag soon because I don't have enough merch for that. But these are fun to have. They're fun to play with. You can throw them at people. They're kind of hard, though. I wouldn't suggest that. Don't wreck your Omanjus. I can't remember if the other box was in the sales section or not, um, but these are also heavy, so they add more to shipping, so I only wanted to get one of them. So these are blind packed. There are eight of them in here. We're just going to pull one out randomly and take a look at it like we always do. 
pull over in the middle. And here's what the boxes look like. We're hoping to pull out the Nagi here, friends. Nobody is surprised I want that Nagi. And I'm wrecking this box. So if it's not Nagi, whoops. Nope. All right, it's one of the, the silver haired boys. Does Sogo have a white streak? I thought Sogo had white hair. I don't know which one this is. Does Gaku have a white streak? I don't know, this is the one I pulled out. Is this Gaku or is this Sogo? It's got diamonds on him. I don't know if that makes a difference. Tell me in the comments below. But he's squish, he's squish. He's a good boy. What color eyes do they have? Gaku has gray eyes, so this is not Gaku. What color eyes does Sogo have? I need something else that has Sogo on it. This could may or may not be Sogo. I don't know. And the last couple of things that came in August were a couple of Nendroids. Um, I originally wasn't going to buy her and then I decided to buy Yumeko Jabami and I'm glad I did from Kakigurui, which is an anime that I really ended up liking. She's number 882. And I hate these small Nendo boxes, but what are we going to do about it? Nothing except complain on this YouTube channel. Woohoo! So she's not my favorite character from Kakigurui, but I still really like her. I still want her scale figure. I think the scale one looks cooler than this, but she does come with her crazy face red eyes and her really crazy face. So it's like the levels of crazy. So we have normal, we have crazy, super crazy, super cray. So she comes with three faces, a bunch of cards, um, some of the Japanese card things. She comes with her little badge thing for like her her pet collar. Yeah, this is a cool Nendo. This is a cool Nendo. Um, I want to buy her scale. If you ever see the Yumeko um, scale on sale anywhere, let me know because I need her. I haven't bought her yet. And then the last Nendoroid is the casual version of Yuri Plisetsky from Yuri on Ice. He's number 874. And yes, the snowflakes are still embossed on these boxes, which is why I love them so much. He comes with his leopard print hoodie and um what does he have Parashki? what does he have on the bottom no he comes with the cat he comes with pacha the cat so this is super cute he's like angry in his first pose but then he's also got this super happy smiling face and he's ready he's ready to be paired with Hodabak who comes out in january i can't wait for that nendroid oh it's so cool that cat's really small i mean that cat's freaking tiny um but I love Yurio, my little Yurio. He's such an angry boy and I love him a lot. And that was everything for my August Ami Ami haul. Let me know what you thought about anything that I got down in the comments below. Have you watched Kakigurui? Who is your favorite character? Personally, mine's Midori. Nobody is surprised. The one with the eye patch, the crazy girl. Yeah, I like her. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts and we'll have a little party down in the comments. If you like what I do and you want to buy me a drink, my Ko-Fi link's in the down bar. If you want to send me something to unbox to this channel, my PO box is down there as well. I post videos on Wednesdays and Saturdays. Do you like that little bump thing I'm doing? It's because I'm skipping over Monday. <laughs> As always, feel free to follow me on Twitter, Twitch, my anime list, or my figure collection. My username's AnimePalooza at those places. And until next time, love your faces.